Have you ever told anyone that you've had kids and they say, oh no, I could never do that. It's too expensive. Well, we're going to try and show you how expensive having a child really is. The shopping is done. It's time to go home. Let's go. So this is the food shop that we just did today. It'll do us. How long will that do us, babe? Probably two weeks. Maybe, if we're lucky. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah one, one or two weeks max. Maybe let's say seven to eight days. If, if we're lucky, as she said. So the only part that really was for the kids is that small pile over there. And we bulk bought, of course. And I think that was that. I think those packs of nappies were maybe about eight euros each. The boxes. So we got beeps, a lot of beeps, because she, she goes through like almost 10 every single day. So we got like a lot of them. I don't know how much that is. We got like a lot of um, baby wipes. Eight packs. Eight packs of baby wipes. Just throwing them on the floor. Biodegradable, fragrance free, that's 16. And, and this is from Aldi, one of the cheapest uh, grocery shop in Ireland. So we got it from Aldi. It's not too expensive, by the way. And two packs of baby nappies. Phoenix is just seven months old and she's into number seven already. And that's the last number. Hmm? <laughs> that's the last number and she's into number seven already. So she's not allowed to grow anymore? Nah, no. nah, you're stuck now, okay? No more growing up. So, how much was this actually? The um, two boxes of nappies? The two boxes, about 17 euro. About 17 euro, so... Mm -hmm. Then... Um, Those were... These guys were about 130 each, less. I got these ones and the strawberry and apples. One thing I would just like to say about the Mamiya brand is that it has really good reviews and there's no added sugar or salt or anything like that. Um, a lot of Aldi, Tesco, if they're ever making their own version of a specific food item, sometimes they might pay a known brand to make those product, product, products for them. So let's just say a well-known uh, baby food product would be Ella's Kitchen. Um, Aldi might pay Alice Kitchen to make food products for them, but they would still labor it as Mamiya. Yeah. So there's nothing wrong with the brands, guys. So Mamiya yeah, is everywhere. We've got a lot of snacks, organic ones. So Phoenix is just after eating some of them already. It's open. I don't know why I'm throwing it on the floor, but yeah. <laughs> someone had to clean it after all of that. And, um, was that all of the, um, the baby stuff? Yeah, so we also kind of include the veg as the baby stuff here as well because we puree a lot of our own foods. Sometimes I would get pairs, like let's just say if we're traveling or if I know that I'm going to be tired, um, but we already have some of the purees already so we didn't get any, get any of those. Okay. So that's the baby stuff done now. It wasn't that much to be fair. It was maybe 30 to 40 euros max in or even less than that. Yeah, it was yeah. like, must be about 20 quid. Yeah. So the, at the moment, she's, she's not that expensive though, but the more she grow up, the more she's gonna be expensive. So now it's just like, make sure she has like nappies, baby wipes, um, some of the snacks, and what else? Like, food wise. Ah, uh, so if you're formula feeding your kids, um, how much milk they go through changes as they grow. So we use Aftermill Organic number two. And we were actually advised by the health nurse that we don't need to move on to number two. But the difference between number one and number two was the amount of iron. Sometimes she may not want to eat what I give her. So I find that substituting with Aftermill number two is not too bad. So yeah, we're gonna move on to our one. So that's the baby shopping done. So today, I'm on a diet, by the way, guys. So um, I just got all the dietary stuff. 
So I go for my breakfast, I usually get this, just the instant oats. And I eat my oats without microwaving it. So literally just mix it with um, milk. And that is it. It's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> then I got some coffee for my night shift because I do night shift as well. And just a lot of um, tin and tomatoes. And the missus got some of this stuff that I've never tasted it. I don't even know what it is to be fair. They're mini pickles pretty much. They're French mini pickles. French. <laughs> By the way, French is my first language, so I can speak French as well. And that's going to be the same with Phoenix. Mm -hmm. See, you'll be speaking French very soon. And um, I got some rice cake for myself. And the missus just got this for both of us. I don't know, I've never tasted the um, salted one. Chile! Yeah. Then we've got something fancy. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> It's leaves. Leaves, <laughs> yeah. As they call them leaves, so kind of on the diet. So we were just eating every all of this fancy stuff. All of that. So I'm going to make a Greek salad tonight. So that'll be using up already for today the cherry tomatoes, the cucumbers, and the steak. We'll go through maybe about four items of this today long. Yeah. So literally. We got all of this that I said at the start of the video that's probably gonna last us a week or two. But I'm I'm hundred percent sure it's not gonna last us up to like a week even, sometimes even like less than a week. We like our food in this house. Yeah, we ate a lot, we ate a lot, like that can probably last us five days because we we're just like assuming it can last more, more than a week, but I don't think so. So yeah, and all of these weekly shopping cost us, I think it was less than two hundred. So including all of the baby stuff and that's what in one of the cheapest grocery shop in Ireland so we got all of them in Aldi now most of them in Aldi and just um, some of these in um, what shop was that? Deals. Deals, yeah, the two euro shops so so for the more expensive items yeah we go to Deals to my let's just say the Fairy Land Bio we go through a lot of this fabric softer because she, she does have sensitive skin so we use Fairy so we tend to shop other, we tend to shop outside of like Tesco's and all the big supermarkets for those kind of items because they can be much cheaper in deals. Yeah. So basically, that's our weekly shopping done. We've got like everything, all the good and the bad stuff. So we've got some chocolate. Chocolate can be good and bad at the same time. Like we've got chocolate, and we're trying to stay healthy now. So most of the stuff are the green stuff like sweet potatoes. Yeah, she doesn't is. like the word healthy. <laughs> <laughs> and we've got some oranges there for vitamin C and stuff. Broccoli. What were you talk, what, what were we saying again about broccoli? Like uh, frozen stuff. So I was on TikTok yeah. and apparently certain vegetables, because they're fresh frozen, which means that they're literally picked and they're frozen straight away, so they hold a lot more of their nutrients in. So vegetables like broccoli, carrots, peas, they hold a lot more of the nutrients when they're frozen. Um, just make sure that it's not the processed kind. But it's also a lot cheaper, just so you know. Fun fact. And, uh, I don't know what that's called, but <laughs> <laughs> the missus love it a lot, so. Butternut squash. Job. Yeah, squash. Yeah. And some mac plants, some vegan burgers and stuff. So literally, hopefully this lasts us a week. So I was just kind of showing you guys, um, like, um, like a weekly grocery shop in in Ireland, how much it costs, and like if you've got a family, how much you can be spending. So we've got all of these for less than two hundred, yeah, less than two hundred euros, and it's probably gonna last us a week or less. So. I know Ireland is expensive, the cost of living in Ireland <laughs> is really expensive but hopefully all of this stuff is going to last us a week so for anyone or people that are thinking of moving to Ireland to have a family just bear in mind that the cost of living is really expensive in Ireland but you can do away with it, you can go to cheap stuff so you can go to cheaper uh, shops instead of going to the expensive one like the Tesco's, the Dunstall, the Super value. Super value. Yeah. Uh, mm. Like um, 
and like spa and class colors that you've got yeah. some bigger. Yeah. So instead of going to all those expensive shops, if you're planning of starting a family in Nylon, I reckon you go to the cheaper ones. So you can go to the likes of Lidl, um, Aldi, and um, the two euro shops like the, what's the name of the two euro shops? Tills and uh, what's the other one? Two euro shop? Yeah. Mr. Price? Mr. Price, yeah. So yeah, the likes of Mr. Price, Tills and all those cheap, cheapest um, shops. So that's pretty much what we got for our weekly shop. Now, what we would like to say is that some of this stuff is going to last even more than a month. All these nappies will probably do us about a month and a half, two months. Yeah. We'll see how it goes. Um, she goes through maybe about four nappies a day, maybe one during the night. So hopefully that'll last us that for the next month. And the eight packets of wipes, hopefully will last us that, that much as well. But we go through a lot more wipes yeah, than we do nappies. nappies. Yeah. The thing like the fabrics on here, we got two bottles, so that'll do us for like the next month. Uh, things like mouthwash and toothbrushes, that'll last a whole lot more. And it's one thing as well that when you buy kind of like in bulk like this, not a lot of the same item. So when you go to one place where they do a lot of stuff very cheap and you plan for the next week or two, you can save a lot of money in the long run. But yeah, believe it or not, we will actually eat all this food in the next. Two weeks. Two weeks? Yeah. I don't think Maybe. it will last up to two weeks. Well, it'll usually happen if we're going to eat all the good stuff first. Yeah. Good year, gosh. By and the then... way, everyone loves this in the house nowadays. Like, we go through one of these <laughs> in <it. laughs> <laughs> Okay. So, thanks, guys. I think Phoenix is tired now. We just have to put her to bed. And put all this stuff away. Yeah. <laughs> Because yeah. Thanks for watching and please tell us whatever you want in the comment. If you want us to do videos like this, just let us know. If you want us to do like I don't know any type of video, just let us know. We're just informing people on on what it's like to have a kid when they don't even know. And I will be posting some maybe some recipes if you're stuck for ideas what to feed your kid if you have one. Yeah. So thanks a million, guys. Bye.